Today we're going to be taking a look at the best custom fit vehicle wiring for your 2016 Hyundai Santa Fe. You're going to have either a factory tow package or a non-factory tow package. We're going to have three options for each one. Today I'm going to help you determine which one you're going to need. On your driver's side behind your rear tire, there's going to be a plastic panel. You're going to want to pull that panel down and you're going to look for two plugs on your frame rail. If you have those two plugs, you're going to have a factory tow package. If you don't have those two plugs, you're going to have a non-factory tow package. So to simplify what we're looking at, we've narrowed it down to the top three wiring harnesses. Over here on your right side, you're going to have the Takancha, part number 118269. Here in the center, you're going to have the Kurt, part number 56332. And over here on your left side, you're going to have the Takancha, part number 118571. Now this one over here on the left, is gonna be for a non-factory tow package. And the two here on your right, Kurt here in the center, and the Takancha here on your right side are gonna be for a factory tow package. Let's go over some of the differences in our factory tow package wiring. One of the differences is gonna be the power output between these two wiring harnesses. Power output is gonna be amps per circuit. For the Takancha, you're gonna have 4.2 amps for your stop and turn, and 7.5 amps for your tail lights, where your Kurt's gonna have three amps for your stop and turn and six amps for your tail lights. Now, the reason that's important, let's say you have a trailer that has more incandescent lights on it, you're gonna wanna lean more towards the Takanchi because it has a higher power output. The Kurt is gonna work just fine, however your lights may not be as bright because of that lower power output. Another difference between these two is gonna be your four pole wiring. Now your four pole wiring on your Kurt is gonna be a lot shorter. What that means is this converter box right here is gonna be open to the elements because it's gonna to have to be mounted close to wherever your four pole is coming out of the back of your vehicle. Well, your Takancha has a much longer four pole wiring setup, so your box, your converter box can be mounted up behind that plastic panel where your factory wiring is connected. Now let's go over some of the similarities between these two. Both are gonna be fuse protected, both are going to have four pole flat connections. And both of our converter boxes are going to have a potting material inside, which tends to help them last a lot longer. Now the reason our converter boxes tend to last a little bit longer with this potting is because this potting material fills up the inside of our converter box, reducing the risk of our wires coming loose and possibly getting damaged. Now as far as installation goes, for these two here, it's going to plug directly into your factory tow wiring. All three of them are gonna install the same. Now that we've talked about our factory tow package wiring options, let's talk about our non-factory tow package wiring option. Out of the three non-factory tow package wiring options, this is gonna be our top pick. Now the reason is, is it's gonna have the same potting material as we just showed you on our factory tow package wiring. Another reason why we picked this one is the power output. It's gonna have 4.2 amps per circuit for your stop and turn, and it's gonna have 7.5 amps for your tail lights, just like our other Takancha. As far as your non-factory tow wiring, all three of those options are gonna install the same as well. However, they're gonna be a little bit different than your factory tow. These are gonna plug directly into your tail light. You're gonna have a power wire that's gonna run up to your battery. In my opinion, if I had a Santa Fe with a factory tow package, I would go with the Takancha because of the higher power output and the mounting location of my converter box. Now, if I have a Santa Fe with a non-factory tow package, again, I'm gonna go with the Concha because again, the power output and the potting material inside the converter box. That'll do it for a look at the best custom fit vehicle wiring for your Hyundai Santa Fe. Thanks for watching and click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave us a comment if you have any questions.